Right. CBS Austin's Raven Ambers is at the hotel where police just wrapped up their investigation. Raven? Yeah, that security guard was patrolling this parking lot behind me where police say multiple shooters shot at two men. At first, that security guard didn't think much of those shots until one of the men came running up, bleeding out, pleading for help. It probably not was revolved because it was just going. You know what I'm saying? Like, you know, the ones you just hold your hand on the trigger. As a security guard, Jasmine Adams has seen a lot, but nothing quite like this. Well, I'm not, I'm not used to all this shenanigans. Two men shot in the parking lot Adams patrols every night. It happened near the northbound I-35 service road in 183 just before 4 this morning. We know that there were multiple shooters, and we know that there was a lot of people involved. Adams only saw one of the shooting victims, a man running up to the hotel who had just been shot multiple times. From what he said, he said he don't know. He didn't look like no threat to nobody. He had no no gun on him. Just like nice, wholesome man. You know what I'm saying? Going on about his way, and, and and somebody probably was just shooting. She says he ran into the lobby, desperate for help. He ran to the lobby. They got blood all oh, like like a chainsaw mask. Adams called 911 and began trying to stop the bleeding. I seen straight through his arm almost. His back. I mean, he had shown his back, but yeah, man, he was just he was just rolling on the ground. Like I said, in agony, in agony, and I had to, I had to cover, I had to put pressure on his arm. That's what she told me to do on the phone. EMS took both victims, a 38-year-old Hispanic man and a black man, to the hospital with multiple gunshot wounds. Police say the Hispanic man died at the hospital. And I get on the phone with my supervisor, and he'll tell me you're doing a good job. No, like, I need a raise. You know what I'm saying? Like I, I, I just, I just saved the life.